Now we're back to CapCut. Let me show you a speed flash effect. At least that's what I call it. It's a typical effect for music videos when people are dancing and the beat drops. Here's an example. I couldn't find a better clip. I always want to use clips that you can use as well. So you will find this in the description link below. And generally you want someone who dances and then you want to cut it and then when the beat drops you want to speed it up and add a little bit of a flash to it. To achieve this effect we'll need some music. I'll just use the inbuilt audio library. This one right here. Usually hip hop music has this beat that you want. And then I'll add the footage. Let me cut the intro. We don't need it. And what you can see are these orange spikes and this is usually an indicator for a beat. You have to listen to the music so adjust it according to what you've got. Then position the slider where the beat drops and then use the split tool. You can, you can press B for that and create a cut on your video footage. Go a little bit forward, create a second cut and select this segment and go to speed right here and then crank the speed up. You can go to the max but but everything up to let's say five seconds should be fine. Depending on the clip that you've got, you want to go higher or stay as low as five seconds. Then you go to the next beat, do it again. We use maybe almost six seconds. As this clip is pretty short, I'm going to use it again. Here would be the next beat. Cut it again, select it, speed, 5 to 6 seconds. And a final one. And this creates this speed effect. So it speeds up and then slows down again. Let me roll it and you can see it whenever the beat drops. We have this effect. To add the flash, we need to select the segment that we've speed up. Then go to adjustments, scroll down until you can find the adjustments. We need brightness and highlight. You don't want to go too high. Five is a good starting point again for the lower values and you can see that already. Let me try this. Ah, oh, maybe that wasn't strong enough. Let me try 10. So for 10 it works better. The values here depend once again on the footage and the colors of the background, the lighting. But this is the process that you can use to create this effect that I've simply called speed flash effect. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.